Yeah, it's probably a case where they threw in some science stuff that's indicated that things freeze up when they die, but they meant it to be the cold kills them permanently. I don't know. It's Resident Evil Super Science. Alright, that's almost certainly going to be a puzzle thing. Let the five bells of this chamber ring out. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, I'm gonna guess that's her. Bells, eh? Bells. Do I hit it again? <laughs> that with a knife? No. Alright, we'll use bullets. These are bells of variable size. Just angry at everything. Fuck you, pottery. Ah, right. Good catch. Ah, probably gotta hit it up here. That's three. Might be one above the lamp. Thought so. Alright, where's number five? Yeah, oh, I see it. Out the window. Yay! Alright, what did it? Hey, alright. Now, where does this go? What fresh hell awaits us down this corridor? Yes. But no, no, no. Back up, Ethan. Alright, we'll use a bullet. I've probably missed a few, so probably pointless, but whatever. I know in the first game, shooting the Mr. Riverware dolls, whatever those were, gave you some kind of bonus, but I forget what it was. Uh... Yeah, I'm not falling for that. That's what it was, yeah, the ammo pile. Hey, treasure. <clears throat> now, what's this about? Okay, kitchens, dungeon, treasure. That's back in the basement somewhere. Hmm. Well, the iron key had a lock down there somewhere, so... We'll be back there eventually. Probably for the last mask. Dagger of Death Flowers. Antique from the Middle Ages. Coated in concoction of poisons from across the continent. Hmm. So a dagger from the Middle East was brought here, but no one knows where it is. Alright. Oh, baby, what do we got here? Oh, 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 oh. oh no! Oh no! I need a bigger case. Oh, all right. Let's adjust things. Maybe we can squeeze this in. 
Okay. There we go. All right. Nice. All right. Let's swap some things. All right, excellent. We got us a sniper rifle. And nothing else up here. All right. Oh, what the fucking fuck? Really? We got us gargoyle monsters or something. Sniper rifle just in time for them. Fantastic. It's coming this way. Wanna be careful with these shots. Okay, these things have like weird beak stinger things. They're almost certainly gonna get close and Drain me or something. Uh, can I get by these guys without shooting them yet? Died easy. Good. And it's some kind of like. It looked like it had a head crab or something on it. <clears throat> like head crab, but more technically. down with him. Yeah, it was basically a mind flare, wasn't it? A flying mind flare. Fantastic. Okay, damn, there are a lot of these things. We need to craft some ammo here. <laughs> they fly now. Yep, they fly now. Part of the problem is, by the time it's clear that they're attacking, we're already kind of too close for this thing. Yep. Huh. 
nice if it's only grab the loot through wherever it fell. Just when I needed it. <clears throat> right. Let's ride the winch with flying enemies all over us. should be able to get out with these. Huh. Right, there are only three daughters. Interesting. Yeah, he had an iron grip on that for using his mutilated hand. Ah, uh, whatever. Ethan's basically superhuman at this point. Unless the plot dictates otherwise. Oh, hey. Now it's working. Uh, is there anything else I can get out here? Ah. True, alcohol makes you strong. Uh, anything through here? No. Eh, you know what? I'll canvas for loot later. Let's continue. Head back down, sell some stuff, save up. <laughs> half human, half zombie. Yeah, basically. Half weird mold creature. Uh, here. Anything else in here? Ah, I see you. Yeah, yeah. Stupid man thing! You won't live long, oh, even no. if you run! Back in the elevator. We're going up. Fuck off. What's that say? Hand sucks. Hand sucks keep. <laughs> uh, that's cute. Yeah, I wonder if part of that was a callback to what happened in the original game when you lost your hand. The hand itself was actually a collectible item. Right, I don't think I can get around this. Right, the fender off. Oh, no, she's leaving. No, she's coming back. Shit. Okay, can we squeeze by her? Pardon me, come in the room. Now you're finished! Ethan Winters! I like how I just kind of muscled past her. Save room. Can't follow Thanks me to the save room. your consistent patronage, I've expanded my services. Those are the rules. You can hear her out there. It's like Mr. X all over again.
Alright. Oh shit. Must be oh, busy. We got a pinball machine. Or something. No, it's marble madness. Ah, here we go. Be with you in a sec, Lady D. Just playing with your toy castle here. And... Yeah! Ooh, I bet the jewels go that we collected go into this. Fragment could probably sell it. Valuable, huh? All right, so it's not combinable. Never mind. I'm overthinking this. Shall I choose something for you? All right, let's sell some stuff. Little and often fills the purse, as they say. No, 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 who, no. I'm buying this because of our relationship, you know. Alright, here, have your lipstick, you creepy, creepy man. Ooh, where did you get your hands on such a thing? I mean, it was right there. You saw me get it. Alright. Definitely upgrade. Aha! Actually, I've gotten some new stock. Please come again. I wonder. Oh yes. Does it do that thing from Resident Evil 4, where if you upgrade ammo capacity, you get extra ammo? Let's find out. Hmm. One moment, Maybe please. Good idea. Hey, free ammo. Awesome. Well then, feel free to peruse. All right. What else do you have for me? All right. Oh wait, hang on a second. We will want Congratulations. More space. With this, you'll not worry about missing anything. Uh, shit. Not quite enough for sniper rifle ammo. The recipe. Can I sell anything? Nothing I want to sell. Alright, we'll get that later. Good day then. Alright. About ready to face her, or at the very least, stall her long enough to deal with her. But I think there's one. There's a lock thingy somewhere around here, and we picked up a lock pick. Do I want to risk it? Yeah, I'm pretty not okay with her just prowling around outside waiting. Like I said, it reminds me a lot of Mr. X in the Resident Evil 2 remake.
Can I get through here again? No, I can't. Shit. Ah, oh, hell. Alright. We have to circle around. Oh, quite possibly. Treasure up top somewhere. Ah, whatever. We have slightly more immediate problems. Alright, you go in this one. You go in this one. Yep. Counter resets. Those are the rules. Not staring, not staring. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that was actually creepier than anything she's done. Just that... Just looking back and just kind of dismissively walking away. Like, I know that's probably just the AI bugging out because I'm doing the I'm not touching you thing in the safe room, but I don't know. I always find it a little bit chilling when it's clear that the villain can see you, but isn't actively pursuing you, but also isn't doing anything especially menacing just looking at you. Yeah, there's some relationship with her and the Duke that makes her loathe to be anywhere near him. Not sure what it is, but they almost certainly know each other in some less than pleasant manner. He is very unpleasant. And I mean, he did buy her lipstick, so God only knows what he's doing with it. Alright, uh... Oh, shit. We're gonna have something pop out of that thing. I can feel it. I think we got a boss fight coming up. No? Ooh, wait a minute. Do we use this to kill him? You've ruined everything! Ah, oh, shit! You know, you stabbed me, I stabbed you. We have so much in common. We should talk. Oh, shit. I signed up for Tall Vampire Lady. This is a little much. Damn it. Looks like your outside matches your inside. Oh, Get 
First. I need a sting for that. Oh well. I like mine better. 
Nice of her to break my fall, though. Like, if she literally landed on top of me, I would have been actually, like, capital F fucked. But, you know, that's how she showed she really cared. She didn't really want to kill me. We just, you know, we're from two different worlds. Just wasn't going to work out. Oh, well. Uh, looks like I'm getting out of this place. Eh, nice of her to land in the vault chamber room with the bioweapon flask. What even is this thing? Looks like a human fetus to me. Eve. Alright, I won't be prophetic in any way, I'm sure. Glass container with this flower and sword's crest. Too dirty to see inside. Alright. Gonna go out on a limb and say this is the... Gross. Bioweapon juice that makes this work. Alright, so we're back to the village. Finish the item that was requested. Please deliver it to the House of the Red Chimney, go through the caves to the ruins, then down to the village. Okay. Uh, is there anything in here? Scrap. Thank you. And anything else? No. Alright. There we go. You're probably right. I think we can head back in and get the stuff we missed. Now that we're no longer being chased by the headline characters of the game. Can I just wander back in? I think the stairs collapsed. Yeah, probably. I don't know. I kind of feel like she went a little too early. I know there's... We're a good ways into the game by now, but there's like three other villains that didn't get nearly as much promo time. And they're gonna have to work hard to follow that act. Uh, Alright, I think this leads back to the village. Like the note said. Ooh, wait a minute. Hey, Fen, it's time! Come here, fishies! <laughs> Extreme fishing with Ethan Winters. Well, hello! Come here. <laughs> There's that sense of power! Damn it. Give. Where's number three? Yes! <laughs> hey, you know, I only gotta get good at it once. Uh, did I get turned around? I think I did. Alright. That was fun. Alright, onward. Hear our voice together as one in reverence. Be called now what? Within the endless dark. No, it's probably that crazy deliver lady. Deliver us into fate's hands. As, as the midnight moon rises on black wings, we await the light at the end. In life and in death, glory to Mother Miranda. Hey, remember me? I almost died up at that castle. Tell me, what is going on around here? How can a man be almost dead? Well, you know, it starts That's with your health meter flashing for the red. Wise. You know what I mean. And I still haven't found Rose. Where did Mother Miranda take her? <laughs> You're too late! Or maybe almost too late. I could just shoot the you child right will here, be sacrificed lady. Life for life. What kind of sick medieval shit is this? She's just a baby. The crests of the four bloodlines may open oh the umbrella sy symbol here we go Will you please stop talking in riddles i just want to find my daughter 
Yep, that's the connection. It's only a riddle if you don't know the answer. <laughs> <laughs> wait a second. That looks familiar. Oh, hey. does it ever. Hey, wait! Right. Okay, so we got us some lore dumps going on here. So, House Dimitrescu, House Benevenito, ben, uh, Benevienito, Beneviento, yeah, I suck at names, House Heisenberg, and House Moreau. This is fucking Game of Thrones. Jesus Christ. Uh, no, I think she put the key in the box. Hey. I'll bet you that goes to the next one. Uh, wing. Fish, horse, moon. Hmm. Hard to say. Right. So, yeah, we're gonna have to deal with these other three houses. No. Convenient. Yeah, you're right, that does match up. So that jar was for her, so each one of them probably has another jar. And we combine them all, and that gets us the reagent to kill whatever the big monster is. Yeah, see, the seam is on the code, okay. It just isn't in shot most of the time. What's this? Seriously. Game of Thrones shit, I'm telling you. And, like, I've seen maybe, like, five or six episodes of Game of Thrones, but... Come on. Okay. Uh... What time is it? I'll push on to the next save point and call it. Uh, can we... Oh, I think this is where we put the things. Or, not yet. Really? You think the pattern looks familiar, Ethan? You think it looks familiar? Just a little bit? <sighs> Why are the ones that can grow their hands back always so dumb? <clears throat> oh yeah, yeah, I, I... After that, I look at every lever now with just a little bit of suspicion. Like, what else are you gonna fucking do to me in this game? Anything could happen. Alright, we got more not zombies coming up. Those are normal people that got arrowed down. Alright, we're back to wolf boys. Come at me, bitch. I've upgraded my handgun. Use the physics a little. Okay, got too clever by half. Winch. 
Ah, okay. I see what I see what the game you're playing here, game. We will eventually get out of the boat. And almost certainly fight some kind of lake monster. Like a certain other game divisible by four. Okay, none of those work. Interesting. Might be a lockpick. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna get out on the boat and there's gonna be some kind of monster out there we fight. I mean, that was one of the, uh... In the children's story, that was at the start of the game, that was one of the monsters, the big fish. I think we're back in town now. Yeah, here we go. Okay. There you are. I had a feeling you would pop up here. It was all worthless. Is that so? I assume you've picked up something of value. Not sure if it's a value, but... Why, you have your daughter right in your own hands. What are you saying? Take a closer look. <sighs> he means the fetus on the cover. <sighs> or that. <sighs> Oh, that's even worse. The flask seems to contain her head. No. What? Roses. Don't say another word. This. This is impossible. This just can't be. Your daughter's essence is still intact. Her powers are truly unique. Who, who could even do this? She can be saved, you know. Saved? From this? Are you insane? There's a house with a red chimney on the western side of the village. Go and seek out the man who lives there. Then we can continue our conversation. Quit holding out and get to the damn point. You don't have to trust my words. But do you have any better options? Your choice. The customer is always right. After all. He'll pay you if I find out this is a lie. <laughs> Fuck Joker. Okay. Well. Put the parts back together. Yeah, exactly. We just need to get the other body parts, get some healing juice, stick her back together. Good as new. I... Yeah. This is getting more fucked up by the minute. Jesus Christ. Oh, man. This is going some fucking places, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, yeah, we're back here in town. I think there's a uh, typewriter in the church. I don't think these bodies were here earlier. Maybe something happened. Oh, what the hell? Uh, what's going on here. 
Operation Day, recorded by NH. Arrived at site, no sign of EW, Ethan Winters, or Rosemary Winters. Infiltrated village, engaged with number of bioweapons, found evidence of EW. RW, location unknown. Established base at church. Plan of operations, LB, TDK, TDK9, search laboratory, NH, UE, analyze mold samples, Alpha, infiltrate factory. Huh. Okay, there's some shit happening. It's gotta be the guys that t kidnapped us early in the as a, in the intro. Leaving the ammo for us? I don't think so. All right. Well, let's save the game. Okay. Yeah. That. Oh, wait a minute. Loot. Yay. Now we save. <clears throat> As I was saying. Yeah, so shit got... It, it, it's trite to say shit got wild because shit's been crazy from basically Jump Street, but that got insane in a record amount of time. And as weird and fucked up as Resident Evil 7 got, there was a sort of grounded grindhouse nature to it by, it, by virtue of its confined setting Th that kept it from going to the same places that this is going to. I'm, I'm curious to see where this is all headed. This is clearly bigger in scope. Clearly they're going to do more things to Ethan to basically torment him. The plot's going to be going in weird directions. I don't know what to expect, and I'm eager to find out. But, yeah. Thanks everyone for tuning in, and I'll try to get to this next week. See you next time.